when you have that bodily experience to an object you naturally want to not just look at it not just take this 2d um, picture with your eyes you want to you want to in a sense like try to touch it or feel it or experience that surface My paintings always float between these two kinds of experiences. They are these aesthetic moments in terms of the, the images that I'm creating. But when you look up close to them and when you experience the surface, you see something quite different. You, you see that there's these extrusions of paint and there's a thickness and tactility to them that is, is kind of camouflaged in, in terms of when you see it um, reproduced digitally. What I always think about when I'm making a painting is the more confounding or mysterious or confusing a painting is to the person that sees it, the better. Um, because I don't want people to have an easy idea of how something's made. And the point of that for me is that when you've really made something new, that's when people don't quite understand it. And so that's kind of when you know you're doing something right in terms of, of making artwork. Um, I'm interested in confusing people. My name is Andre Hamer. I'm a painter. 